At least I still have two weapons as a gladiator. Uh, swords, there we go. Yeah, Dex is all right. Um, I'm gonna throw just yet. Do I even have anything to throw? Presumably. Some of my normal two skills of like fighting and oh wait, that's not right. Uh, long blades, <laughs> weapon skill, and then I'll probably get some dodging after that. So I with a dagger in one hand. Oh, I got dispersal. No, that's the wrong book. I got one of the translocation books, but it was not the one with uh manifold assault in it. Ooh, seven and. Oh yeah, the most eggs of the gladiator. Oh yeah, seven and. Hmm. That's fine. I'm sure I can do something with seven and. I okay, can hope for some items that increase it. Do I want to hold up? I can. Oh, it's so slow swapping weapons. It's just I could use a staff bulk in my like offhand for poison resist, but it's not going to be a very good weapon in general. I feel like I'm slaughter slaughtering all these early monsters, but I presume things will get harder fairly soon. A dagger protection shines here. It would be nice to have one of those in my offhand. What sort of, like, uh, weapons have I even found? I just think it's just basic stuff. Like hand axes. Or uh, decrease attack speed of main attack. It gives you AC. Yeah, it would be excellent. Alright, let's get some decks. Well, the other thing, the other option is the intelligence. Hey, Sigmund. Uh, no thanks. I got no willpower. I've got... Yeah, I think I just died to Sigmund. Oh, well, so much for that rig. Oh, dagger of poison is good too. Yeah, if you can have a dagger of poison and a dagger of uh, protection, you might be doing well. I mean, you wouldn't be doing the long blades then, but oh, come on, not Sigmund. Ow, you almost burnt me to death. All right, where's the way down? Oh, Electrocutioner's ultimate? I mean, I guess it can do some pretty good damage. And later on, it would definitely be better than having, um... What? I walked straight past the rat. Having, like, uh, poison. But I find poison early on is just so amazing. Especially if you meet some bees or something and you got no poison, from just, just kill them first. Distortion's gone. Like, imagine having distortion in each hand. Like, what your chance of actually bouncing something would be. Like, a, a dual wield. Oh, an arc blade. Probably won't get the money for it until I've already got something better, but hey. If I suddenly acquire a ton of money, I think that's the way to go. Oh, Sorcerer is hands down the best brand in the game. I haven't used it much. I don't know if it is the best brand or not. It's overpowered, do you think? I, I feel like I just haven't used it a lot. Um... Although if you were dual wielding the Storch and Quick Blades, I imagine that would be ridiculous. It'll also be reasonably hard to get. I mean, Laganu could give you one, but I don't know where you get the other one from. Oh, you use it in uh, low turn count games. You just wait for like, stuff to go away. You just like, banish everything to the best. I mean, I guess that works. Interesting. Oh, I guess you can like, blink stuff away and then run as well. Oh, ow. I think I can get out of here. <laughs> uh, hey, Sigmund. Oh, he did notice me. Oh, I hate this. Um, quite one of these. Heal wounds, okay. I guess that's fine. I did kill him, but mm, he was questionable. I had robes slightly more dodging, but otherwise pretty identical to what I had. Uh, oh, if you have a distortion weapon and you worship Wujin, you move one square and everything adjacent just suffers. I mean, I guess... Hmm. Guess you could almost just, like, run through the entire game just distorting everything away, but I'm not sure you could... I mean, you might be able to make that work. Oh, I gotta kill this guy. Ah, uh, I hate this. I think I... Oh... I think I just eat the attacks, but one more smite could finish me off. Yeah, I mean, it's just a cockroach, right? It's better than saying with a smite range. Alright, that's fine. Um, So much smiting! <laughs> 
And it makes us an army of priests to so kind of smite you. Oh, you made it work with a vine soaker, so did Backler? Oh, you beat your score with it, though? <laughs> uh, I'll have to try with something. Maybe. Not sure I could, uh, not sure I want to go for, like, low turn count, but I feel like I want to try with something. Oh, plus five trident. That's better than a dagger. Like, sure, it's not something I'm good at, but... Still 15 damage with a, who knows what, attack delay. I mean, it makes my average attack delay 1.0, uh, what was it, 1.2 or something, which is, hmm, whatever. The extra reach is kind of a little bit wasted, though, unfortunately. I don't want to convince you to even, uh, try low turn count. No, I don't think this character could do long turn count, um, unless they got some regen or something. I have done a little bit of long turn count before, but I never got, like, super low with my turn count or anything. It was almost, it was always, like, just barely scraping through with the gems. Are you doing anything else shattering your scores? Fair enough, I guess. You've already got, uh... Want well, Sergei to do that, right? I was focused as you are on this game. You could uh, get the high score, no problem. I don't know. I've never been great at tone count. I mean, I've got some decent runs, but... I've never been good at, like, shaving off turns. I feel like that requires so much focus. Um... Oh, you don't think it requires so much focus? I don't know. I feel like I was always, uh... Trying to figure out ways of shaving off turns and... It was like all the manual exploring and everything. Uh... Oh, focus means hitting the O key? I feel like when I was doing, like, low turn count, I could never auto-explore because it would just take way too long. Um, I had to figure out like roughly circular ways to explore a level if I didn't want to take too many turns or something exploring it. Oh, whoops. Oh, it didn't even step back. Sometimes, if you're fast enough attacking, sometimes after the ogre hits, you can just step back. Oh, no, I missed. Okay. I mean, it broke my net, but I mean, that's about dying. <laughs> Let me get out of here. Uh, not there. This has got to be the right one, right? Oh, wait, the other one was unexplored, was it? Oh, that might have been fine. It was just showing as a spot kind of in the middle of the floor. Uh, I don't know if I really need a holy rest, but oh well. Are you dive always barely explore flaws? It's rough. Yeah, I know, like, you can be super underleveled. Um. Like, uh, end the game at under level 20 or something. I don't think, uh, my was quite got that serious. Oh, it's back up to me, but I might be to kill it. A short sort of speed. 8 damage point, 5 attack delay. 15 damage, 1 attack delay. Um, and this one is 16 damage, 1.3 attack delay. That almost works. It's something I could like put in an offhand weapon or something. Oh, there was a damage and attack delay on this one. It's 1.3 attack delay. I don't know if this quite makes sense, but I'm gonna put a... I'll try a short sort of speed in my offhand for a little while, see if it makes any sense. <laughs> I'm not convinced it does, but my attack delay is 0 0.7.8 now, so I'm definitely attacking quite fast with this my offhand. Or if you don't get to land by, uh... Oh, trolls your way in hopes of, like, grand tails, but if you don't get it by land branch, you usually die. Yeah, that's true. 
because you um if you're super under leveled and you don't have any good armor as a troll this really and that's kind of the point where the game starts turning around like trolls before they just kill absolutely everything was well, a guy that just won with all-time high score in ohio that played a dwarf like a wait a dwarf what the all those scores like meteorants last i checked Oh, it's, uh, it's specifically the Ohio one. What's the what's on the leaderboards right now? Are these all oh, those are real time ones, turn count ones. Oh, there's still some deep dwarves up here on the turn count ones. Interesting. Huh. That was actually recently recent. Deep dwarf one. All right. But yeah, the meteorites are taking the top spots mainly. Oh, there's a troll that managed to make it into here as well. That's kind of impressive, getting a troll up there onto the actual leaderboards. I mean, I guess that's uh, Saffa, like the ridiculous uh, turn count runs. Alright, let's go down a level. Feels weird, like, not picking up, um, any of the jewelry or anything when I see it. I don't think a falchion's worthwhile. 15 damage point 9 attack delay? Or oh, maybe. It's the same damage as my sword, except slightly higher attack delay, because it's actually got a positive enchantment bonus, unlike my sword. Another little guy that can smite again. I think it's fine. Ooh, that's a lot of points. I think I can still kill this guy. Then I can run away. But a dagger of venom might make sense as an offhand. My attack delay would go up, but I think poisoning people up is probably worthwhile. Let's give it a try. Uh, gotta walk back, of course, to swap weapons. Because Cognitors, I think, take a whole... Is it 10 turns to swap a weapon or something? Yeah, it is. All right. Five turns like equip the weapon, and five turns to unequip it. All right, where's my behemoth? There's a behemoth. <laughs> you better give me the good spells, behemoth. I'm not sure if behemoth's gonna give me anything that's actually useful, though, because I don't think uh, manifold soul is a gift, unfortunately. Um, Jax, of course. How are my skills going? I just gotta get the dodging up to like six or something. See if it makes any difference. Ooh, plus three longsword's good. Uh, I might actually put it on my long hand. I mean, I, uh, my off hand. I know that dagger and venom is kind of nice, but I think I might just go with uh, two long swords. Oh, plus five great sword. Fortunately, not something for me to use, but it could actually hit reasonably hard when the enemy has it. Uh, that's... Hmm. I think if I split these, it might be better than trying to fight the both of... Oh. I'm giving it a few chances of an attack of opportunity, but I think it's not too bad. Oh, it's got a pole arm. Um, the other guy still sleeps. I think I just woke up to it and kill it. Uh, uh quick deal because they got minus eight corrosion even with like two weapons it's not gonna do any damage i mean it's two chances but yeah they both weapons are corroded so they're not gonna do any damage a oh, plus four long sword nice i got the falchion i can replace with that one this is good fighting some nice swords here uh, which means i can probably drop like most of the stuff honestly uh shots of speed yeah i mean i'll just drop everything i think I don't have a way of getting fired this. I'm gonna avoid Maggie because she's got the ball of fire. Oh. I guess I just go fight her, but ow, this could hurt. Hey, the dead to the trick. She's got a steam dragon armor. It's probably better than plus it, uh, one robe or something, right? Yeah, it is. It's more protective. And it's as lightweight as a robe as well. It gives uh, steam resist. It's not like full on fire resist, but that's something.
All right. What is my attack delay anyway? Oh, hammer venom. It's very rare you see a hammer venom. There's a cloak in here. I can take crazy youth. Yeah, but he's weak at the moment. But I wouldn't want to be any more level uh, beneath because then he could just get really lucky with his chaos and take me out or something. Is that a falchion? I want that. Get that here. I think that... Wait, not a falchion. A scimitar, I mean. No, falchions are the bad ones. Yeah, plus two scimitar. All right. I'll take it, but I'm pretty sure it's going to be better. 20 damage point, 9 attack delay. 22 damage point, 9 attack delay. Yeah, I mean, that's just better. Um... I can't poison up, but I don't think I can retreat. The only thing I could have done was like a uh, water quicksilver or something, but I don't think I needed it. Also, the bees are just so good at dodging. I mean, I guess it applies to my weapons as well, so they can dodge out of those as well. Move up to the Steam Dragon. It's probably fine now they've got the Steam Resist. Ah, uh, good old Ring I can't wear. It's a Ring of Evasion. I should read the scrolls, probably identify. There we go. And I can go identify. Oh, Tratch and not the most useful. Berserk Rage or could be useful. Curing, alright. Teleport. Hey, you can actually use the teleport now. It's not grayed out. Feels wrong not be grayed out after playing a pharmacist. Oh, wait, boots. I can, I can do some of those. Uh... Oh, wait. I'll take my jewelry because usually at this point in the game, like sometimes I'll occasionally have picked up an item that I haven't noticed or something, but no, of course not. As a coglin. I gotta wait an extra four levels to get any kind of jewelry. I will do the curing. I don't want to be confused while there's all these bees and priests and... Mm. Not great for retreating. I'm just gonna have to fight. Okay, Porkhouse is nearby. That's a good sign. It's not very nearby, but we'll see. Are you doing all right? Yep, I'm still alive. So that's uh, something, Oswald. No, I've got some better uh, weapons here. Like, I've got a scimitar and i got a longsword. So that's an improvement. That's uh, it's this way, I think. I have no acid resist. Um, oh, well. Pull it in close. It's the closest thing I can do. There we go. Found it. So I've got... Inventory space, let's go into the pork cows. Oh, no, it's this one. It's got Prince Ribbon and it's got... Oh, what is it? Some sort of human. Um, a Vault Guard or something? Alright, let's get the swords to 14. I think that's probably enough. Um, fighting can get to 12. Charging can get to, like, 8. Oh, Evo can get to plus 3. I can get, like, 5 of that. That's enough skills, though. Ah, human offering sting. Good old human trying to give me a first level spell. I don't know if I'll end up taking any of the offerings. Um, but I don't think you get translocation. I think I can kill Prince River, but I'm not sure about the Vault Guard. I feel like that might be too tough. I don't have a way to fly, do I? Hmm. Oh, they're both together. I think you could have to teleport. Um. Hey, I killed the kill Prince River, so I gotta avoid the Vault Guard. Could throw boomerangs at it. Um. Got Quicksilver. Might be okay. Don't want to be next to it because it's like so bad. I'll just take it out with the wands, I think. Uh, there we go. Took it out. Didn't even get any heads on me, but if it had a good head, it would have done a lot of damage. Oh, there's another one there.
Wait, what did, was Quicktip always full rage? Maybe. There we go, that's another one down. So it's got a good old broad and it's got plate mail. I'd go with light armor, I think that's probably what I'll stick with as this character. I don't know if the loot I got here was worthwhile, because I did spend a lot of quicksilver, but it wasn't too bad going through there. Um, yeah, I mean, I'm not after a broad axe, so I'm just gonna get out of here. It is a high tier thing, though, so... It's not a bad option trying to get uh, something like that. Ooh, plus two hat sounds worthwhile. I've got a uh, nothing. I'm not gonna help it. Okay, but I still get an armor class, right? I was well enchanted compared with unenchanted. Oh, plus two scimitar. And I have one uh, plus two scimitar in both hands, I think. So I've currently got a plus four longsword, which is doing 22 damage, point eight attack delay, across rounded. This one's 23 damage, point eight attack delay, of course, also rounded. Uh, although, are they the same skill requirement? Um, they might be. Let's see. Uh, 14 skill compared with 14 skill. Yeah, they are. So I might as well just drop these ones if it's slightly more damage. It's less, slightly less accuracy, but this is definitely a better set. And as I get more skill, the difference in damage is going to increase. This is going to be higher base skill. Alright. Unfortunately, none of my scimitars are flaming, which is going to be a better problem than I kept uh, fighting Hydras later on. Uh, that place wasn't too bad, they excluded up. It's sort of like a... What's it called? A Hornet. I wanted to approach it from another angle. And unfortunately, that's not really a choice right now. Um, oh, I missed the Curare. Okay, got it with the net at least. Oh, the net hardly lasted. Got no resist, right? That's a uh, classic Coglin. Then 14th level, you get a few resists, and then um, you usually struggle. I've actually had a Coglin get basically maxed out resist before, though, and that was wild. Because I think I had an elemental staff in one hand, and I can't remember if I had the other hand, but it wasn't too bad. Um, oh, what about electrocution? Hmm. Can't even remember what they got their willpower from. Oh, leather armor, fire resist? Yes, please. Uh, kill this guy and then I'll put it on. Oh, and this guy as well. It wants to be killed as well. Let's see. Yeah, I mean, that's, uh, I think, the same armor class, except now I've got fire resist. So I'm not completely uh, down of resist anymore. I've got death store, haunted revivification. Oh, that's. That's not bad of all assault. <laughs> So I don't really care about it, but I'll pro probably try to get Gels Gravant with this character as well, if I'm going for Manifold Salt. Hey, Fog, alright. Five of them even, that's a lot of Fogs. Oh, Might, Might's great with Coglins. I always forget to use my Might, but it's like really good with Coglins, because that Might's have both weapons, not just one of them. Those Fugue of the Fallen. What do I need to get a Fugue going? I need a better Necromancy. Um... I gotta try it. I get like eight necromancy. Is that enough to get me a to get me a fugue? Cause I slang's kinda nice when you have two weapons, right? <laughs> because the downside is you do actually have to remember to cast it and that can get kind of annoying. Uh Wow, the chance of going down fast. It's already on 36% failure. It's not on like 86 or something. Yeah, you can see like every time you kill a bee, it drops like if it's sad or something. I don't know what the sun's seen horrors. Um, there we go. If you get them back into corridors, like you know, you can just hit in one direction and constantly until they die. Um... Not always the best. I got fire resist leather. It's, uh, what's better? Fire resist or the regen? Hmm. That, oh, that guy's not good. Let me just fog up. 
I'm actually going to try and pull it close. Yeah, because otherwise he's going to sit there hitting me with barbs the whole time. All right, what have we got? Oh, alignment? Alignment's great. Oh, it doesn't even notice me. I thought, like, casting the Fugue would, like, make enough noise that I'd pull it in. Because I thought Fugue was, like, a somewhat noisy spell, but maybe not. Um... Do I just actually have to be in, like, melee range when I kill things with Fugue, or... Is it just killing them enough to charge it up? I don't know, we'll find out later on, I guess, whether I can do it with a Manifold Assault or not. Um... This is kind of a tough level 10. It's got a lot of dodge level 11 creatures. Well, I guess that's alright. Yeah, like these Cyclops guys and uh, Manticores and that sort of thing. I don't think I need the Frozen Ramparts for you, but... I mean, I might take like some Ozzycubus armor or something, but I don't think I'll take a Frozen Ramparts. Uh, 7% on the Fugue's probably fine. Or any evocations up to eight. I thought I'd probably bring it up to that anyway. Anyway, let's get not that. Let's get the long blades. Try and get that up to fourteen because that will hit my mid delay on these weapons. Uh, I'll do one more level here, but I'm not sure it's a good idea. Oh, maybe not a good idea with these boulder beetles around. Uh, try to like poison up as best I can, but it's rolling at me. Can I stop that? I don't have a net, do I? Do I have a paralysis one? But probably not. Nah. It messed me anyway. Plus, uh, six draining glaive of willpower? Okay, oh. Uh. Oh, what that creature is. I'm not doing a very good job. Um. There we go, got it. Uh, the openness of this level is maybe not very good for this character. Because I don't really have any ranged options right now. Nope. I don't think those stuff is that good. Uh, and also it was a royalty, uh, the orange team, and that was... going to be a problem. Alright. I'm slow, but I think that's uh, that's fine. There we go. I think the fugue is working all right for this character. Um, oh, a helmet. That looks nice. Plus one. That's just about the same as my cat, I think. I'll try it on. Might be, like, gradually more armor class uh, if I got any armor skill, which I actually don't think I do. Mm, although I could chart something. I could chart my hat and make my boots or, I don't know. Oh, my helmet, I mean. My drops are these older. All pieces of junk that I seem to have acquired. Actually, I should stand off them when I'm charting myself so it doesn't add up their series stuff to the list. So I want to chant the helmet, definitely. I'll do the boots. I reckon there's a chance I replace the cloak with like a um, scarf of resistance or something like that. I mean, obviously, I could replace the other one as well, but I think it's less likely. Which had some digging. Oh, I do have some digging. Man, that's really nice. Otherwise, I was kind of in trouble there. I probably would have needed to teleport it out without that digging. Uh, no, nah, normal light doesn't work because I, I, uh, fadeably two handed here. I've got a scimitar in each hand. Oh, I should do. I'd do the cloak. Yeah, why not? Because I go light armor, so I'm going to probably have uh, no shields. So I'm going to have some um, chant armor left over. It just makes sense to charge up whatever I can at this point in the game while I'm still... Well, to give me the best chance of surviving early on. Three potions of resistance. Nice. I'm nearly done with this level. I'll just hide over here. Oh. I'll see what else the mark pulls in. Good. Not too much. Just crystal spear silence. Silence is alright. I'm not sure if I get it. But anyway, let's go to the lair. What are the silence spell skills? I never remember. It's like... Hex is alchemy or something? It's not probably not alchemy. Hex is air, okay? That probably makes more sense than Hex is alchemy. Like, that didn't quite check out.
I do just keep on attacking. Good. If it hit me again, I probably would have needed a curing, but, um... Wasn't too bad, my health. Well, if you counted for the bed, they could have queued up. Um... Oh, was I just did a single potion? I meant to do a stack, but I didn't. Also, do I have a flaming weapon? I do not. So I'm just going to have to avoid Hydras and hope I don't go down the staircase next to one. Because if I go down the staircase next to one, I've got to hope I've got some fear or something. Um, I don't. Well, I bet I saw the identifying some scrolls, I think. And hope for the best. Or just hope I don't end up going down the staircase next to a Hydra. Um, did I ever get a flaming wand? I didn't, okay. I think it's still worth killing this guy. Uh yeah, this shaft is not great. Um I think it's put me in an okay spot though, thankfully. Oh, cause fear. What did I get? I got um necromancy or something, right? Hmm. Only a fourth level hexes, but I don't think I'd go for it. But oh, there's a hydra, eight headed. How much quicksilver and stuff do I have? That was actually some pretty good damage. Uh oh, now the shark after me. Um. Well, okay, I'll let it get a little bit closer and I'll berserk up. That's my dead, but I killed it really quick with the berserk. So it doesn't get a chance to um, berserk itself off or something. Which is what it would have done if I gave it a chance. What is this? Blinking dice. Well, I guess that's something that might be able to save me for a future hydras. Although, oh, there's another hydra. Uh, I'm killing them okay with the wands. Yeah, I mean, I know I've got like eight uh, evocations. You know what? I maybe should get a bit more because I'm going through the ones kind of fast. Um, maybe 12. But I got plus three out It's fairly cheap. Thirteenth level. I think I'm one level short of getting a gizmo. Um, we'll see what uh, options it gives me. Hopefully it's a regen ones. We'll see. I think the region one's got some magic regen on it as well, at least it used to, which is kind of nice. Although I think there's maybe separate regen ones, I can't even remember. I was doing the scrolls, I can't even remember what I was after anymore. Um, probably like things like uh, fear and stuff. Got the blinking though, so I guess that's pretty good. Uh... Poison. I don't have resistance to that, but it's not bad. Oh, the statue form. Oh, there's a fear. I, I kind of, kind of do want to do the statue form. Um, I just have those skills to what they want to do, and then maybe we'll get the statue form. Is resist electric uh, uh, poison immunity? I think. I keep on forgetting to put on this fugue. I knew that would happen, but I got it. I knew I'd forget to put it on in some of the fights. Okay, I'll just quick with this guy. Finished off with... My boss? That doesn't really work, does it? Oh, it did. I blew up all its heads. It my my boss. It was my way up. But no, I don't think it's my best does bonus damage because it's got more than one head, unfortunately. You gotta target the heads individually. Oh, brand weapon. Surely, yes, yeah, that was a good brand out of that. Let's give it a try. So, let's do on this weapon. Uh, Venom? Yeah, that's good. I don't want to do on both of them. I want to save one for when I get better weapons, like when I get, um... What am I, what am I talking about? Like, when I get, like, Demon Blades or something, which I probably will eventually. All right, Le I think I'm down to layer three now. I've done layer two. Uh, oh, it's a shark. Nah, it's not working. I'm going to berserk it. Yeah, because that just kills it so quick. Maybe I should have tried to mite initially, but I don't know. I think the berserk might have actually been the right thing. 
Just that's my last berserk potion, so I won't be able to do that with future sharks. Uh, Fog Body does lots of cold damage, I think, but I might just pull it back. Whoa! Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hey, it sure does do lots of cold damage. Um, if I blink here. That doesn't work, does it? I'm not slowed. I think if I blank up here, I'll take out max view distance, I can just retreat. Okay, and I could probably get back to a staircase that way. It probably would have been fine if I didn't have an electric gear or electrocuting me at the exact same time. Um, I mean, I might have probably still have to do something to get out of there. Am I going the right way? I'm going kind of... I guess this works. This does put me through a shallow water, which is better of a worry. But I think it's my lost track of me by now, which is great. Uh, there it is. Okay. Can I paralyze it? Unfortunately, I spent like half my time walking up to it, but I guess that works. Okay, um... I guess I can mind bust the shark before it gets up. I mean, it's 80%. That's pretty good. Oh, wow. That actually destroyed that shark. I didn't realize those were quite that low on their willpower, but I guess that works well for me. There was an electric gear on there, but I killed the main one, which is a bog body. There's sometimes a second, um... Bog body in here, but I don't think there is this time round. Alright, I got the swamp, but uh, if I get statue form, that will have a lot in the swamp, I think. And statue form is also really good once I get the manifold soul going, which is unfortunately not that close yet. Let's get the shape shifting to 14, and then I can probably put on the statue form. Uh, I'm impatient. I'm gonna take it to, um, oops, 13, and then put on the statue form. <laughs> I know, like, the mid scale that it uh, requires is, like, 16 or something, but because it gives bonus health, it's not too bad before that. Alright, Death Yacht, follow me back. I'll just pull one of these upstairs and hopefully be able to fight it. Mm. Curari, okay. There we go. So it looks like every death yank I fight is going to have to be curari in order for me to kill it. It's not the worst thing ever. I do have four curari, so it's definitely something I can do. Sixty percent of the way up a level. The good thing is, if I level up again, my gizmo, so I'm, I'm seventy percent of the way up the level. I'm looking forward to this, but it's probably going to be really near the end of uh, doing the lair. And I can choose to resist to light up. Well, that actually just died. And I choose to resist to light up well with um, what I'm going to get from the statue form as well. Okay, can I buy burst of Hydra? 69%. Uh, nah, the, the quick though, I kind of want to keep it a quick though, but it's just so good at killing the Hydra that I kind of use it. Uh oh. Oh, I guess the quick silver it is then to kill the Hydra. Threw in a few by busts, but they didn't quite do the trick, unfortunately. I hope that's the last Hydra. Uh, might not be. Just running out of the Quicksilver. So I found a big chunk early on, which was amazing. Hey, um, I just mind burst the shark, right? Yeah, that gets it dead really quick. And oh, so close to leveling up, but I gotta go down to that level. Um, I fight a four headed Hydra. Uh, Oh, the mind bus actually working this time around. I mean, I guess it's down to random chance whether it actually fakes it on. 99% of the way up a level. Come on. This elephant might be able to love me up. Let's see. 
Hey, there we go. Excellent. Let's go on Vet Gizmo. So, I get a Rev Parity one with Cold Resist Wizardry. Oh, Wizardry's nice. Or I could get a Magic Regen, Regen, Resist Poison, Resist Lightning, Resist Corrosion one. Oh, I like the I like the Regen. Um, res, uh, Magic Regen one. But the Resist line up with the Statue Fall, which is terrible. Or there's a Fire Resist Slay Plus 3 Clarity Repel Missiles one. I'm kind of uh, really tempted to get the... Rev Parry Resist Cold Wizardry Magic Points one. If I'm going to be casting Manifold Sword, I gotta have Wizardry, right? Uh, can I go without the Clarity? Probably. Repel Missiles is nice, but I'm not gonna have a shield. Yeah, I think that second one, unfortunately, the Resists are just too grouped up with stuff I'm already gonna get. Um, I gotta take that first one. I know the last one's also pretty good. I got a lot of stuff that, like, doesn't quite do anything just yet, like, be human. Doesn't do a whole lot just yet. Um, that was wizardry. I also kill one of those without my few god. Hey, I won't be able to use a few in here. There we go, look at that, charging up. Oh, well. Uh, it's petrified. I guess it's fine. Just, I don't want to be petrified as well. But I guess everything that's trying to get to me is also going to end up petrified, so that's not too bad. Um. Yeah, but I should probably retreat back now and get all the way back to a staircase or something. I reckon. I don't think this. Oh, actually, this. Revved up, why don't you do something there? Well, those guys are dying way easier than they were the initial one I fought. I barely managed to kill my throw a Curari dart at it. Um, does a Rev Parry gives me AC? It's like 2 AC every time I attack until it fully revs up, I think. I don't even remember how much AC it gives in the end, but uh, it's alright. The fuck is 5 AC in total, right? That makes sense. Um. Oh, I had a Tydra. Um, so I got five Mind Bust. I better just keep a go with the Mind Bust. Oh, nah, that needs, uh... I could just finish this off with a Whopping, because I seem to have found a ton of those. There we go. And that's like a guaranteed hit as well, which is nice. Why do I show the jewelry slots here when they're unavailable? It feels like when they're limited by your species, they don't really need to be there. But it's no harm with the big there. Um, I keep a check on that statue for this age as away. I might get a time for my first lab branch. I probably will. Oh, not Diophant. Uh, I definitely can't fight at the same time as the troll, but if I fight them separately, it should be okay. Maybe. It's not poison resist, which is good. I don't think I can paralyze it. 13, no, 12%, nah. Oh, it's no longer curaried. Um, there we go. I got rid of it. So we got, oh, wait, where do we go? We got a box of beasts and we got a vial of floods. And I've got some evocations, so those should have a decent effect when I use them. I just lose my... I think I lost my Curari when I used them on the, um... Dude, but I will. They're down to two needles. Or darts, or whatever they are. Anyway, done with the last, so let's go to Dungeon 12. Either Dungeon 12 or Orc Mines are probably both fine. I don't have much resist. I have Cold Resist and I have Fire Resist. Um... That's a lot of archers. <laughs> Hopefully they both uh, still be next to the staircase, or at least reasonably close to the staircase by the time we go down. Alright, we've got Scrolls of Immolation. I should probably do potions though, because I got so many more of these stacks. Like that's, um, Ambrosia? 
Oh, whoops. Apparently it's possible to be to identify, but I guess that's fine. Uh... I got Hellfire, Mortar, and Animate Armor. Do I have a Silent Scroll? I have Father Floods. That's basically a Silent Scroll. <laughs> All right. Oh no, don't step in front of him. Uh still would have logged, thankfully. Oh, he's no longer would have logged. I gotta tell him out. I wounded him. He's poisoned, he might die. I think uh did he no, he's not dead yet. Might be able to finish him off with a wand though. There we go, got rid of Jog Run. Um, yeah. That little wraith coming along was kind of annoying. Don't think it managed to slow me down, though, at least, so it wasn't as bad as it could have been. Right, what do we have? Uh, I was trying to identify this one before. Taste, I, uh, but I accidentally caught the wrong thing. Rove of willpower, I have the fire this armor, I think. Wasn't there something else you can wear a troll as run, but probably not. I think I'll keep the fire regen one. Okay. Fire regen? What am I saying? Fire resist one. Do I want also cubers? I don't even think I can cast that. 99% failure. Oh, but I probably should get the fear. Um After I get the statue form. Because I got the wizardry, so that makes it uh, a bit more in my favor trying to get any specific spell going. Uh, what is that? Hold it to protection. That's fine. It's not gonna like better me up or something. <laughs> I'm just checking. What's this one? A plus one hold it? Okay. Probably both of them up. Uh, activated box beast. This is not gonna work. Uh, ow. Ow, these are absolutely murdering me. Um, fear's got to get one of them, but then the box of beasts might track something. Okay, that did the trick. Why my beasts to still be attacking? All right. There's a walk around here somewhere. There it is. Let me go kill that one. I'm glad I had some fear and stuff. I had some blinky as well if I had to. Uh, I think I got a reasonable number of that even. Actually, six blinky is quite a decent chunk. All right. So many tad skill that uh, transmutation or well, shape shifting a minus two aptitude, so it's slowing the whole process down a little bit. Uh, although I think minus two is like basically average, isn't it? Or is it minus one? I can't remember. I know the average on the shape shifting is definitely negative. Um, oh, ow. I want to kind of try and start with a bit of warping. Uh huh. Good chance of heading with the Quicksilver. There we go. What's this you guys' chance of paralyzing me? I hate how that's 20%. I got five enlightenment, so I'm just going to have to use one. Because um, if it paralyzed me, it probably just killed me with some bolts of draining. I've had that happen before. It's always such a terrible way to die. Um... Because there's basically nothing you can do once you get paralyzed. You just have to press space until you're dead, effectively. Or enter, or whatever it is. I think either works. That's definitely a 
point of retreat or get terribly corroded. I'm a few upgrades they got held. There's only one of them. <laughs> that only really makes sense with this multiple creatures, which stops the rest of the Orcish mines. So I should be doing my fugue a bit more. Yeah, you can see that's wrapping up quite nicely. That fugue can tell more off, of course. Man, I got all these things that rev up. Like my normal tanks rev up. Uh, my parry revs up. My fugue revs up. Just kind of like coglin life, I guess. Whoa, hey, the spell trap. These are weak ones, though, apart from that one down the bottom. I might do the, do the alignment again, but I don't want to burn through too much of my alignment, because otherwise it won't happen, but I'm getting banished or something. All right, uh, yeah, I mean, it does make sense to get the decks, I think. How many things are still waiting in here? Because it's... Oh, wait. Oak Warrior has a war race. It doesn't have anything good, but... This guy's going to get attacks on me. It's probably fine. Um, I could have tried to hit it with a Curare if it was a big problem, but I think... I think it just makes sense to retreat back. And then go down another staircase instead of that one, of course. Because that was all surrounded by Orcs of all kinds. Uh gonna have trouble fighting when it's like just that um orc as well. Oh. Yeah, I need enlightenment, but then what? Um I don't like the look of these guys. Can I just hit them all with the warping or are they not line oh they are lined up for that? Good. Can I actually get back to the staircase this way? Didn't I leave like some really tough orcs around it? Am I gonna have to teleport out or can I just wander? I guess I can wander back. <laughs> that seems fine, but yeah, there's probably orcs wandering around right next to that staircase somewhere. Like that guy. Oh, does it get mined up? There's no chance of me fighting that guy whilst mining up. I'm gonna have to go down somewhere else and wait for it to unmite before I fight it. And also I'll get rid of all his friends before I fight it. I'll probably get it with a Curari as well. If I'm gonna have any chance of taking it down. Okay, I'm offered a battle sphere. I don't even use any spells that I think trigger a battle sphere, unfortunately. I have a human. No, my spells aren't really destructive spells. Um It's not paralyzed or something. <laughs> this is why I didn't go paralyzed for a second there, but no, I was, I was fine. It wasn't even the type of guy that paralyzed, so that would have made it harder for it to paralyze me. Come on, I have metaphor sold this shop. We've got a manual pull on spatial translocations. I don't think it's the right one, is it? Uh, blink, less affecting momentum strike. I mean, I can get a blink, I guess. That's not the right set of spells. Um, feeble yars? I might be able to grab a yars. That's not quite what I'm after. Sticky flame, flame wave, okay. Look at a K as Mata I nailed the spell dead. Okay, sure. Whatever, we've got a lightning rod here. We've got a blinking here. Blinking's well worth it. I get some identifiers I need it as well. Alright, let's check out the other shops. Maybe there'll be something good. Ooh, ooh transparent crystal blade armor. How hard would it be to cast manifolds on some transparent crystal blade armor? Um <laughs> Oh, yeah, well that's so we do. That's better than trying to get some uh plate armor. I think that one revs up as well. Alright, let's put it in my yeah, oh, I guess my off head doesn't really matter. No, my primary head. 
The one that's not Venom branded. That's definitely worth having. Okay, got one excellent weapon. Can't even, like, get charged up or anything. Um... I might grab the identify from that. <clears throat> um... Yeah, do I save up for the Crystal Blade armor? I don't know. It's going to be such a such a challenge casting in that. Uh, what have I got? Dungeon level 13. Oh, actually, no, I don't think I do. I nice to the look. To, I think I just go with the statue form. I don't think I do Snark Blade anymore. All right, well, I could try the helmet. Get a plus two helmet. Probably not even better, but... Eh, whatever. I'm going to try. That's plus two helmet. Yep. Yeah. It might have been like an intelligence or see invisible or something, so I think it was definitely worth a try. Alright, um I'm gonna be a full delight oh. <laughs> I'm out of money, okay, sure. I'm not gonna be able to full delighting roll at this rate. What's this all do? I mean I know it like fires and calls people. Yeah, I think that's what I think that's its main thing. It's also like it charges up its um enchantment bonus. Have I been up all the staircase I have? I have frost, I could have resist to that. Um, there's also nezzles here, which is awkward. Ah. What would happen if I put it on a statue form right now? 80% health? Hmm. Oh, that quite checks out. Um... I gotta put it on anyway. See how it goes. Uh, so I got a bit more armor class. My evasion's doing probably about the same. That's very distant mounting archway. Those guys are massive. Um, doesn't help with actually getting the archway being in the statue form, as it turns out. Everything melts apart from my cloak and helmet. I see that makes sense. Lose my fire resist? Oh, they get marked. Um, Nezzles has bad willpower, so he should just be able to polymorph him. Do a yak or cyclops or a lindworm? Sure. I hate block. Can I polymorph block the orc as well? Let's <laughs> see. Cyclops throw glass eye? Sure. Now a fragile statue. Oh, but I'm fine. <laughs> Don't even have to go up or something. Well, that was kind of fun. Polymorphing all those guys. I do get here probably in time. Um, I would have dropped like all that mountain stuff, which is a bit of a problem because I can't easily get to it. Don't need the amnesia right now. I'll keep the brand weapon on me, I guess. Um, is that enough? Yeah, four slots is fine. Let's go in. Got one color resist. I don't think I can do anything to get to some more, but that's probably fine. Oh, hey, statue. Yeah, those, uh, those guys can definitely do some damage to the, like, ice, uh, the simulacrums when they hit me and I only have one color resist. Oh, Chanda, we probably have something. Uh, oh yeah, cloak will do. That's probably that. Well, I mean, I'm not going to get anything to enchant for a long time, I think, after this. I'm flaming these guys up at least, which is something. Um, Phantom is not doing as much though. Which means I do chop... I don't know if I chop extra heads off the simulacrum reminders. I think you need... I think any weapon works to chop heads off those ones actually. Uh, Necromancer has got a 30% oh, chance on Agony. Uh, just kill it, I think. I think it's fine. Yeah, there we go. Shape judging 13. I was going to bring it up to 16, though. I really do need to get some of the other skills, but I suppose I can wait a little while. How are my boots? It doesn't really matter. They're melded. That's how my boots are right now. Alright, well, that was not too bad. Sometimes that would have some really nasty, like, ice fiends and stuff at the end, but not today. It's got a dagger, flaming, and a rapier, freezing. Sure. Uh, it will gain heads at the same time as it loses them, right? I think. Roughly. 
Yes, the Hydra's not too bad. Ooh. Hey, Rupert. Um, yeah, he's got lots of paralysis. So I just got to find my third staircase and clear the staircase out from there, I think. Come on, if Metaphone Assault. No, it doesn't. Metaphone Assault should be somewhat easier to get going. I mean, it's seventh level and I have no intelligence. It's going to be the hardest part of that. Uh, oh, 8%. I think I just berserk up, actually. There we go. Yeah, make sure Rupert dies really quick. Because like, there was nothing I could do to get that 8% lower that I know about. Because I certainly can't swap to any jewelry or anything. That was this dude. Quicksilver, huh. I mean, I guess it does want to shoot the Quicksilver through its friends, so... Something. Uh... I don't have a thing to enchant, right? Let me go check. Nah. And I've got a... Uh, oh, enchant weapon. I don't even have a weapon for my offhand yet. Um, well, not a good one anyway. I've got a Venom Scimitar, which is alright. As soon as I find like a Demon Blade or something, I'll just enchant it up and put it on my, in my offhand. Oh, not just bug. Um... I don't think I've even got scales pure alchemy. I could totally get a nauseous bog to be slowly wading through a bog. Does a bog slow me down as the statue? I'm not sure. It probably does. That sound scroll is good. All right. Um, where do I have to go? I've got the swamp of the snipers. I haven't found any fire resist. I think I had fire resist for a little while, but not anymore. Ooh, I've got a requirement. Um, habit of regen. Minus three intelligence, though. It is, uh, strength doesn't help that much. Ah, uh, I also lose two armor cards when I put it on. Hold off. Is that worthwhile? Um. Strength doesn't do that much, does it? Strength doesn't even do anything? Because I'm not using a shield. I'm not, um, using heavy armor. Uh, let's unmeld my fob so I can drop my gloves, boots, and body armor. Good, so those are currently unavailable, currently unavailable, currently unavailable, good. Is it going to be like a uh, Lodal here or something, or is it just a bunch of ogres? It might just be an ogre band. What might be low down now that I've got a bit of resist electric going for me? Oh, hey. Um, Agnes is not a good time, Agnes. I kind of wounded right now. She doesn't have positive resistance, but she is really hard to hit. I'm still going to try and get her with Curari. It's something like 40% though. Ow. Uh. Oh, the beast behind her. Good. There we go. I got to like, uh, constrict it for a little while, which was really helpful for me finishing her off. Oh, um, hmm. I guess this is all right. I've met him off. That's a title for the shape-shifting. I... I think there's still... Is there still the shapeless ones or something? When you get all the skill or something like that? I don't know. I don't think it's uh, one that... I've, well, I'm not even a shapeless Coglin. Shrove requires the Archipelade to fudge it. That's basically just money, isn't it? 2,000 gold I can get in? That's actually doable eventually. I mean, obviously not right now. I don't have 2,000 gold lying around. But... Yeah, it's definitely on the more doable side for some of the troves, I think. I don't know why I'm taking this, but sure. Uh, Down with the dungeon, so... How do I get a fire resist? Ah, this is bad, because uh, I've mean, got to resist this potion, is that it? Well, the swamp kind of needs fire resist as well, just like the snake pits. 
Because uh, Swamp has a uh, Will of the Wisp, and the Snake Pit has uh, Salamander Tyrants. Mm, oh well. Probably just gonna have to rely on resistance potions. That's a uh, Coglin way, I think. Oh, Revelation, one of those. That's not many. Hey, Azrael. His main problem is his damnation. I think that's actually fine with all these fiery guys. Yeah, there we go. And he's got a scimitar of flaming. What do I want? A scimitar of flaming or a scimitar of venom? The, flaming's, uh, the venom's got one bit of brand. Actually, I think the venom's still fine here. Oh, wait, requirement? I don't think I'll take that helmet. Unless armor class and minus intelligence is not that great. I mean, the regen's nice, but I'm not going to do it. Gloves of fire resist. Ooh. Oh, demon blade of electrocution? Oh, the gloves are unavailable in the statue form. I might just go with the demon blade then. Yeah, I mean... The Book of Blood doesn't have manifold salt. That's uh, so like some hydra. Um, what's it called? Salvation blood, all that sort of stuff. Right, let's put this on on my offhand and charge up. I'm fine with this, Brad. Large fusion, yeah. I mean, that's just fine. Hey, Nicola. Um, I do have a vial of floods? So if I just step a little bit close to him, I'm resistant to electricity, so I'm probably taking about the same amount of damage when he electrocutes the both of us. Okay, what have we got? Um, mutation? Sure. <sighs> Shapeshifting is where it needs to be. I was getting... Probably actually need a little bit more long blades because I think it's 16 skill for... Um, my current one. I'll get... Dodging, I'll get fighting. Let me check. Thermic engine, that's not it. Yeah, 16 skill. Because it's a double sword. Whereas the demon blade will require probably only 14 for that one. Okay. I'm already mentally on my demon blade. I think Unibots need even less. They need like 12 skills or something. Uh, how do I get to that shop? I think I'm going to go downstairs. Yeah, I'm going to go downstairs to get to the shop. It's just an armor shop. So it's unlikely to have anything that I can actually wear in statue form, unfortunately. All right, he is like endless bookshops. Okay, this is fine. I think. I've been worried about things like Vashti trying to sneak up on me and stuff. Vashti could do a lot of damage with archery. Um. We'll get teleported around me, but I think that's okay. There are a few like empty spots around me. Oh, they didn't get teleported around me. That's surprising because that was a like an actual guardian seven, I think. It should have been able to teleport around me if it wanted to. I guess it just didn't want to. Probably gonna have to hope for Sky Resistance, I think, with this character or at least something of fire resistance. I don't have a lot of slots for it either. Oh, I can't fly, can I? He would take jewelry every time I want to fly, but like, that's not gonna work. Um, Salamander Tyrant, I don't know if I can do anything when there's creatures around it, actually. Because it's a little volcano thing, like a little eruption, I think, heads not just itself, but like the guys around it as well. I don't need a Salvatore. Uh,. Yeah, going this early with the human was a little silly, but hey. I kind of just wanted to stay with the human, because, uh, I mean, sure, you could have gone with, like, the shiny one or something. They abandoned and grabbed the human later on. That would have been an option. Some god that's easy enough to abandon anyway. Uh, cancellation? Yes. It will make saving up for the trove longer, so I might just grab a little bit of it. My relative enlightenment is more here. Actually, a lot of good stuff here. I don't know if I need the cure right now. I need to go check on that. Cure got 10. I've, I've got tons. Try 
Try get up again. And again. Okay, it didn't work. Um, I try again. There we go. That's fine. I don't think there's any fear or teleports or anything. I mean, these guys are actually won two battles, mainly the guys that used to be the little tough ones anyway. All right, plans uh, go downstairs. Look around. Oh, so many snakes. Uh oh, I should have bring these three up. The problem is it's so hard to bring things up with these nuggets. Although I've been doing real, like, really to be lucky, I think, with trying to bring things up that I haven't been getting constructed that often. All these won't move up because it's got a pole on, but I guess the rest will. It used to be highlighted red. I, did I gain a level recently? I mean, I guess I got some skill. Hey, uh, it's Tankman. How's it going there? Fun to find a crazy goglin. I mean, I got really good weapons. They kind of carried this character. And uh, the human doesn't kick into gear yet, unfortunately. Uh, I've tempted just a... Dump a whopping in the middle of these guys. <laughs> yeah, that was kind of funny. Just uh, watch them all disappear from sight. Delay them getting to me at least. On oh, the Thermic Engine. Yeah, the Thermic Engine is so much fun. Can okay, add it to my list of things that charge up though. Oh, I better resist. I think this is alright. Might need a healing potion, we'll see. No, it's fine. But I had to resist. Those guys do so much fire damage. And I have no fire resist, unfortunately. Uh... Also, his statue form probably rocks on Goglin, but it did It certainly does. Because I'm... Well, in theory, I'm trying to get some casting going, but I haven't really done that. Wait, I was about to get the cause fear going, but I forgot. I've also been totally forgetting to use my uh, few key. I should use that one. <laughs> Get some slay going, because each attack is only doing like 30 damage or something, so... Adding a few on top is not a bad idea, for a couple of slay or something. Depending how many creatures I've killed. What's your gizmo? It's a... Uh, what is it exactly? It's a rev, parry, cold resist, magic points plus four, wizardry one? I think there's only one quicksilver dragon now. Yeah, which is way more reasonable. Two was always insane, because you can never escape them. Oh, do I just do swap? I guess so. I don't have a flight and I've checked. I've checked my like uh rings and realized I had no none so many times. Oh, this is one of the fiery guys. At least it moved up to me. This gizmo is not too bad. It kind of vaguely complements the resist I'm missing. The only thing it doesn't give is like fire resist. Also, how am I doing with giving Hydra's heads? I think I'm neutral in that respect, right? Vaguely neutral, depending which weapon heads and which weapon misses. But I also might slow the Hydra's, so that's nice with my cold brand. Alright, first off, the swamp done. One down, one well, three to go, I think. Well, just under three now. So I started this one already. How have your games been going, uh, Tech Man? Have you played any today? Have you actually tried the, like, the cosplay challenge one? Because I did that earlier today. And I got, like, super lucky. I got, like, a... Oh, what was it? It was a, some sort of a tower shield of ignorance, and it was as a former said, so of course I could use it. But that one was kind of fun. Um, I would like full on fight it. Um, I think I tried an alchemist run earlier, and it kind of died. And then I tried a fighter run, and I think that one died. And I tried another fighter run, and it worked. Well, not starting as a fighter, but like going into fighter. But that's why I've still got my jam timer on, which is about to time out there. Yeah, I lost that jam, but that's not a surprise. Especially as a statue form character. Because that will require me to get gems. Although it let me break the gems, so like it wasn't even that hard. 
Uh, sure, I'll find my way back to the staircase. Although, was that all three staircases? Oh, it is two. Oh. Oh, you didn't hear? You have, uh, have you tried what? Uh, you're trying to get a draconian fire elemental list. Uh, the cosplay challenges. Um, like the one that Rogue is running. But I presume not, uh, if you're doing a draconian fire elemental list. I haven't played a fire elemental in ages. Are they any new spells, or are they the same old fire elemental list with their... I, mean, I guess it depends on you from when. Uh, I think the last fire spell I knew about was like plasma beam. I don't think there's. I don't think there's been a new one since then. But I haven't cast all the new spells yet. Does that cause fear? 10% failure, all right. Ah. Oh, Hellfire Modder was pretty... Oh, Hellfire Modder, it's a fire one. Yeah, that's so much fun. I love the Hellfire Modder. <laughs> I'm not sure how it would be as your only spell. I've never had it as my only spell. I've always had it as like a backup to go with my other spells. Um, And it was really good. Like, I could just like shoot out the mortar and then leave it a couple of turns while I did other things. And then it would go do a truckload of damage to stuff as I ran across the screen. I gotta bring a dodging up to 15. Fighting up to 18. Okay. Uh. I presume you'd want to get a Hellfire Modder on your character. Or do you already have Hellfire Modder? Just to, uh, like, try it out. I remember it being good on the character that had it. Um, oh, ow. I'm getting burnt up here. I'm not taking as much damage as I thought I might with those guys. I know those can be a real big problem. Those, um... Okay, so, oh, speaking of fire, the human thinks I want to fire with a fireball spell there. I don't know, I feel like a Sif Mata might have been a bad choice, but if I do get the human going, it will work. Uh... Oh, you do, uh, you do try to try it out. Uh, you had a fun multi-elemental character go recently for one of the challenges. Right, for the... What was it? What? Which one did them? I know there's a number that required, like, elemental spells. Um... I know I got one in like the... Oh, who's that dwarf guy? Wiglaf. I know I had some go in that one. <laughs> I feel like that one did require... Okay. Um, Do I have a roots? Why try and uh, delay these guys? Oh, okay. That didn't work. Uh, I can mirror... Uh, ow, I might have to blink. I would have loved some roots, that might have done the trick. Did my Lunar and Hydra just miss or something? What's going on there? It had a ton of attacks, it did like nothing. Um, ah, oh, that's terrible. I think I got a blink though. I was hoping my Lunar and Hydra would do something. How do I slow this guy down? Morphic is not what I want. Um, that would quick over, but it's not that effective, right? Man, without my mirror, I don't think I can do that. Uh, cause the mirror failed me, unfortunately. I might just get out of here and come back. Read a teleport. Uh, then get this guy with a bit of warping. Right, okay, um, let's go to the vaults. I can come back to that when I'm a higher level when I can grab my rune. I mean, I'm basically done. I got, like, basically all the XP from the brunch, so... Yeah. Actually, just a matter of picking up the rune now. Bit of a shame about the blinking scroll, but I've got uh, lots of those this run, right? I've got like five left? Seven left. Yeah, more than I thought even. 
Uh, what does the detour dodge do again? Are those the ones that do confusion? I feel like they might be. Doesn't matter. I've killed the guy. I gotta presume they're the confusion ones. They're not the berserk ones, right? Or are they? Hold on, let me just uh, search for these. Uh, hold on, I can do it with this one. Oh, unfortunately, your game crashed. Why? What was it doing when it crashed? It was search and failed. Commando CC. Uh, okay. Can I see what it was doing before that? Not really. Sure. <laughs> well, that's not massively helpful. It's just some sort of research that apparently was uh, triggered there. Which means I'm back to the beginning here. Yeah, this time we start marked. But let's go hide in the corner. But that was when I examined it, guys. So it probably wasn't really to do with commands. I know it kind of, it was probably to do with more examining people that triggered that. It just, it was the command to examine is probably why it triggered at that point. Uh, can't help but getting excited when I see shields, but I don't need one. <laughs> I'm a coglet, I never use a shield. Ow. I wish I had fire resistance so I could just blow these guys up. Um, I might have to teleport. Oh, I probably do. Cosby had, like, got a few of them, but I didn't get all of them, unfortunately. Mm, yeah, well. What have we got here? We've got a demon whip. Actually, I need to take my money. Hold up. How much does that arc blade cost? My trove wanted the arc blade, so I might just go into my treasure trove right now. Uh... We just checked the treasure trove actually wasn't that arc blade, but I'm pretty sure it was. Let's see. Uh, give arc blade to the treasure trove. Yup, that sounds like a plan. Uh, go to treasure trove, dodge level 15. Yeah, I said that one wasn't going to be too bad because I mean, I just want an arc blade. All right. Give an arc blade? Yes. It gives me a heavy double sword plus nine. Let me try that in my offhand, but it's going to slow down my attack delay. Imagine that with manifold assault, though. Oh, still 1.3. Is it really? There's another one in here. There's a double sword of protection. Now it's probably worth my demon blade. Uh, I don't really need a triple sword. Oh, God. Wait, Sword of the Doom Knight with minus cards. I don't have that many spells yet. I've got a couple. What even is this? It's a... It's a long blade. Oh, it's a great sword. Never mind. It's two-handed. I haven't got to use the Sword of the Doom Knight before, but I guess I don't get the start here. Oh, more double swords. A Holy Wrath. Distortion. Can I manifold a sword with, like, a distortion double sword? Um... There's good choices there. Let me just drop some of the stuff I can't use, like the Holy Wrath, uh, or the two-handed Holy Wrath. Here's a double source of distortion. It might be good. Also, are my scrolls, like, all stuffed up now? Whoops, what'd I do? Uh, it's obviously not the right thing. Uh, I'll try to look at the auto pick up. Yeah. Yeah, I'll mainly fix it. It's just I have the I still have the option to like stop auto pick up when I drop something. So when I drop all my scrolls and potions to get in a trove, they decide not to auto pick up anymore. It's I don't know if I like that option or not. It's almost useful. I wish it was like if I dropped like one item or something. Oh, force and fuse a lot. 
Uh, it would still have a lot to pick up. Do I want... Mm. Upper... Mm, nah. Mm. This is silly, but I'm going to grab it. <laughs> I'll probably never get a castable, like, but like... I don't know. I've never cast a spell before. <laughs> I'd love to get a castable. No, I don't think I'll ever get it castable. That's mainly just what I think of my hopes and dreams for this character. That wasn't Metaphor Assault, was it? I don't think so. Uh, that's not even how you spell Metaphor Assault. Uh-huh. Well, I don't have Metaphor Assault. Okay. Those aren't Zen Alders, are they? They're silver statues. And they're, like, really sparkly as well. I think the Zen Alders are, like, sparkly as well now, which is kind of cool. No, I'll just check next time I see one, but I'm pretty sure they sparkle now. Uh, I guess with this heavy like doubles on my off hand, it's getting sped up by my um thermic engine or something. It doesn't seem that slow swinging, but I thought with the statue form, like it should be kind of slow, but no, it seems reasonable. What's the damage like anyway? So 70 damage on one of them, 36 damage on the other. I mean, it's obvious which one's the heavy one that's slowing down my attack. Looking at those damage numbers. Also, the Thermic Edge is effectively doing a little bit more, so I should charge up my Fugue more often. Uh, nope, <laughs> lost the Fugue again. I've got a quick to solve this game recalling, I think. There we go. Easy enough to do when I've got, like, I think I've actually got a pretty big chunk of quick seal, right? Um, yeah, 24 of them. And I used so many earlier killing Hydras. I was kind of surprised how much damage it was doing, but I guess I got a decent amount of evocation. Okay, I got like Shadow, Fire, Swamp, Chain, I mean, that's just a random selection of ninth level spells because I'm not a mage. So there's nothing for a uh, human really to go off there or what spells to give me. Well, I actually do have some spells, but they're not, uh, not elemental ones. Like the Fugus, Necromancy, and the Cause Fears, Texas. I already have my Fugue, and I cancel it up by accident? Oh well. Actually a good spot for the Fugue, because the creatures that to come in big groups, so you can charge it up to a decent level. Whereas before, I was having trouble charging it up much. Alright, well, Vaults 2, I guess the uh, sensible thing is go down to Vaults 3. What happens once the Fugue gets up uh, to 7? Doesn't something special happen? I don't know, because it's... Maybe it's just showing that it's at its max by putting, like, the little, uh, carriages around the number. I'm not sure. Please don't recall on me. Oh. <laughs> and it did it three times in a row. Okay. <laughs> Not like, uh, I'm actually short of these ones, so we can kind of have the battle of who can last the longest with it just spending all its tons. Well, it's actually kind of losing health, but it's spending tons to not really do anything. Well, I'll use my ones, but that's about it. I still can't identify it. It's like, what's missing of my identify stuff? Torment, experience, invisibility. I didn't even get the um, spiders there, so lack of invisibility is probably fine. If I kill this guy, I should get rid of a lot of... Uh-oh. Uh 
Okay, that paralysis doesn't last very long, but that means that's a full of vampire night. They've got to enlighten. Oh, it's almost dead. And it still made sense to enlighten, I think, because it would have still had a good chance of paralyzing me just the second time. Although, do you get a short duration of paralysis immunity after getting paralyzed? I can never remember. I know with banishment you do. Um, I can wear the helmet, but I guess I've already got one. Yeah. Setbacks, I'm not getting frozen, but there's going to be a number of these next to me, which is a bit of a problem. What do I want to get? Um, I can't get shields. I can get, I can get more fighting, I'd be sure. Uh, get dodging up as well. I'm gonna check for translocation spells. See what I've got. I've got dispersal passage of Galabria, apportation. All right. I gotta see if there's anything special about this. Your weapon is temporarily enhanced by the souls of the damned, providing slag bonuses that increase the uh increase with every enemy killed. At the maximum bonus, foes adjacent to your attacks suffer pain. Okay, so it does do a special thing. It didn't used to, but it does now when it's fully wrapped up. Which doesn't happen that often, although it's happening reasonably often in the vaults. Something a lot more often than in any other branch that I've been doing. How much pain do they suffer? I don't know, it doesn't say. And do I need... I guess it's based on necromancy skill. Might just be the pain brand. Whoa. Oh, 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 okay. Put down some clouds. Oh. Really? Everyone apart from the guys I'm trying to get? Come on. Might just have to teleport out. We'll see. Uh, I could take... Maybe not. I mean, that would do right. Um, wait, are these shapeshifters? They just both done the same thing. So it's like, wait. Are those actually shapeshifters? I think they were, though. Yeah, so much to chat over. I think you've got oh, there's an extra one in there as well. Uh, sure. I'll do my quick so Oh no, I'm a tree. I'm a confused tree. That is bad. I do have a cancellation, but that leaves me kind of wounded. I think at this point I'm gonna have to blink out. I don't think Fear's gonna do the trick. Unfortunately, but yep. It get definitely have to get, get out of there. I mean, that's those guys are just keeping something a real nightmare. Um, all right, level twenty one. Of course, I get some decks instead of intelligence. I think, yeah, I think I'm just gonna be full of decks with a scared. I had to walk up to this guy. I don't think there's really anything else he could do. Okay. See them running around here. Okay, there's two there. If I just hit the quicksilver this way, does a decent amount of damage. There we go. That cleaned them up. But they like bind up each other's spell casting, and then they can like summon even more things. I think. Um, how mm, how terrible would it be to go to the Alvin Halls with no willpower? Or is it better to go to the depths with no fire resist? I think depths with no fire resist might be the most sensible thing. Um, like, obviously, there's plenty of things in here that do fire damage. Ow. I think this is still fine. I hope I don't need a healing potion. I don't need it just yet. Just trying to get back to the staircase because I wanted a decent way from it. Um... Well, dude started throwing rocks at me.
Uh, Amnesia is like vaguely useful, but not insanely useful or anything. Okay. I don't need the brand weapon. I've actually got a good selection of brands there anyway. I'm fine with heavy at the moment. It was maybe not the ideal brand to have when uh, I'm not manifold assaulting. It would be pretty good for a manifold assault, which is the uh, hopes and dreams of this character. It's been a manifold assault, people. Uh, spatial translocation is blinky, I think. That's a distortion weapon. Uh, yeah, a whole bunch of chaos. Not the distortion chaos, because um, it's zomb here. And we've also got Ozip. Ghost, a Spriggan Fighter of Okawaru. Oh, they do a lot of damage. Like, 60 damage or something? Wait, what sort of damage is that? Freeze. Oh, I do have a bit of cold damage. Resistance, only like maybe like 50 damage. I still think that's a terrible idea. At least like a... Mm, it's not a good idea. It might be an okay idea. That would definitely be a terrible idea. With a Caustic Strike of no resist uh, corrosion. But I think you'd have to either dig or... Doesn't even give loot I can use, apart from maybe the book. Ah. If I had Metaphone Sword, I'd figure out a way to pop that open. I think it's what you got to dig in. But it didn't, so... Because <laughs> yeah, I could probably do it with like a few teleports and stuff. Like you just, uh... No. Oh, still... Oh. I still have statue forms, so of course it can still... Yeah, me with the least rapid deconstruct. I was trying to like move away from the walls and like, wait, hold on. I am the wall in this situation. I'm actually not that sure to teleport, but I get some. I haven't been getting the Everlate because I've got no fire resist, so. <laughs> Doesn't do a lot until I get fire resist. Well, it could blow me up. Some of these are fire damage, but I think it's doing just fine. Yeah, they kind of go into the meat grinder. Wait, is that a way up that I haven't been up? I'll try it. Stuff room, right? I feel like that's very not useful, that stuff room. Except sometimes it has, like, the elemental stuff or something. It's like, oh, that's actually really good. But the majority of the time, it's not great. Um, one enlightenment, I might use it. There's so many guys here that paralyze. I might still have to teleport out. But at least I'm going to get rid of some of the paralyzing guys before I had... Oh. Uh, still got my will and hearts, which is great. Yeah, that might have been fine. That just, uh, yeah, got through all the guys while my willpower was enhanced. Uh... Oh, it's like fiery guys again. I might leave this for a little bit just to try and do a bit of the rest of this level. Oh, more fiery guys. They won't give me a break, will they? But I guess these are just dragons, which I seem to be doing just fine against. Um, that guy's already petrified me. Okay, that's fine. If that had been like any other spell, it probably would have been a worry, but... Nah, petrify is fine. I draw some clouds of these, but I'm not sure how useful that will be. Mm, I feel like those clouds just don't appear where I want them to a lot of the time, but I guess they're okay. Alright. Let's chart weapon, hold on. I know my current weapon can't be enchanted, but I could enchant some of my backup ones. Like my Holy Wrath. It's just so slow to swap them. Oh my distortion. The distortion, I think, could be a good idea with manifold swords as well. Trying to keep things away from me just by distorting them all around. Oh, at least sounds like a fun idea, even if it wouldn't work. Um, ow. Oh, I think a healing potion.
Okay. I think it might kill like Bones again because they got plenty of those at least. But at least close these, I should pull these guys close. Although, unfortunately, I lost my door, so I can't do that trick anymore with that one at least. Uh, bring out the beast. It's like, oh, like a tiny beast. Well, I wouldn't mind a larger beast, but that's fine. Um, I think my skill would hasn't improved since uh, day just my beast size would have gone up or anything. Uh, oh. Quicksilver Dragon. I was going to teleport out, but maybe not. Maybe I just hit these guys with some fear. Oh, wait, that didn't work. Uh, you know what? I might hit these guys with some summoning. That very didn't work. Oh, where's the staircase? It's a long way away, but I'm gonna have to blink back, unfortunately, because this is not working at all. They're gonna have to teleport out before that Quicksilver Dragon gets here, which might not work, judging by the fact that I can see that Quicksilver coming, Dragon coming along. Um. What do I have to help get me out of here? I don't know. Might up that guy. Hopefully that distracts something. That didn't get me that far, but it might be long enough. Well, get okay, far enough to heal up at least. No oh, dragon. It's an electric one too, so it's like really noisy. Except it did do his electric breath, so I guess that's okay. Good, I'm kind of pulling these guys back um, to a bit more of an insane spot to fight them. Mm -hmm. There's a ghost of paralysis. But I think I'm out of the enlightenment. Oh, I won again. I thought it was out, but hey. As long as there's nothing else around this, Sphinx is paralyzing me. It's completely fine. Come on, be mad of all the salt. Maxwell's very random is like Maxwell's uh pile driver, whatever it is. Wait, no, is it? Portable pile driver, that's the one. Um I don't know if that's that good, but hey, I might grab it anyway. Um Yeah, once I finish the training, I'll try to get a little bit of translocation, see if I can Do a pile driver, see if it's any good. But I think it's got like a minus move cooldown afterwards, which I think could be a bit of a problem. I think it's one of the targets things next to me. Now, do I have uh, Vise, do I? Because Vise could be nice. Well, the tra classic translocation spells when you need them. Clearly not where I'm looking for them. Oh, another book? Come on. What do you got? Summon small mammal? Nagratize? I think that's fine. Uh, still want to get with on the side of the statue. I know it's just an ice one, so it just flow a stream of ice beasts towards me. It's still not the best. Oh, there's another book in here. Let's go see what we've got. Uh, I got a stat. No statue, you've got a guy that can hit me with smites. Toxic Radiance Mercury Vapors. Alright, they don't seem to be hugely high level spells. I wonder whether that's an actual thing. Or whether they're just kind of random books. Probably just random books. Uh, there's another one here though. Oh, 
Even more guys. Try it again, man. At least I was using cold, so I'm resistant to it. It's got lightning spot, ice jolts, sure. As the pitfalls are looking for like one or two spells. Um there are a range of spells that you could use. Can I get to the... I can't get to the statue. Be kind of slow, but I think it's fine. Oh, it doesn't even notice me? That makes my life so much easier. Trying to run up to that one, it doesn't even notice. Alright, next level, I guess. That was a kind of tough level. I think it cost me a blink scroll, but... um, Yeah, it's kind of a sketchy situation there where everything was just swarming out at once. Book of Pals not in, is it? The Book of the Dragons. It's got Dragon School, but it's also not it. But... The acquired something. Let me go grab that one. I might grab the silence as well. Alright, so the acquired gives me double sword protection. I don't need that. I got a granite talisman. Man, that's disappointing. I might just get half my money back. Did I even get good at throwing? I don't think so. It's kind of preserving against a manifold assault, and I didn't. Uh, anyway, I was going to get some translocations up to like. 12. Oh, that might be too much for a pile driver, but oh, uh, hey. Also, I keep forgetting my fugue. <laughs> Guess I remember them this time round. I think I'm just sleeping in the middle of the room. I feel like I need to find a bed or something. <laughs> and this game doesn't even have beds. Like, the monsters don't <laughs> actually sleep in a bed. They just kind of chill in the center of a room or something. Get their rest that way. Oh, for me, the most comfortable. It seems to work for them. All right, so I gotta get... Well, do I do that to go get a rune now? I mean, I can do Vaults 5. This is the right sort of character for that, I think. Uh... Nine enchant armor. I might just leave them on the floor. <laughs> I can come back for them if I need them. Alright, so read the teleport and go down. Mm. Teleport went off too quick. There's a chance of that happening because I'm so slow at climbing down staircases. <laughs> hey, that's not too bad. Uh, I mean, they can still see me to do bolts and stuff through, but... Kind of the closest I'm going to get into a choke point in here. Looks like my initial landing spot is a decent one. <laughs> I don't know what that spider's doing. Sure, I think lead me out into some other creatures or something. Oh, whoops. I... Could have stopped that guy recalling. It's fine. It doesn't bring too much stuff, but I should have stopped that guy recalling. Because I had the Quicksilver. I just obviously missed the turn where it's about to recall. Oh, nice. Good. Blinking. I've got seven of those. I think I can actually buy an eighth one as well. Ah, good old ring of decks. Uh, so many characters, uh, like so many decks based characters would want that one. Not a Coughlin. Just like that shield, so many decks based characters want that shield, but also not a Coughlin. Alright, I might just go around the outside this way. I think that's probably not a bad idea. Uh. I can't poison resist. I think this is fine. I can't, that's right, I can't wear gloves. I totally wear, like, those gloves. I don't think I've even got use for my magic points, so I'd love some, uh, oh, whatever that one was, some fusion to give me some more damage.
Oh, wait, it should. Meh. Uh, the fugue up. There we go. What's the damage like on the... So, I rev the Thermic Engine up to doing 45 damage? Well, that's even that revved up because I'd already lost, like, some of my, uh... Enchantment bottles, sort of, I think. That's my, right, second rune because I gotta go grab one from Swamp, I think, still. Because there was a little Nan Hydra and I've charged up my mirror so I can have a, another crack at the mirror <laughs> fighting the little Nan Hydra. It might do better this time round. Plus line chainmail there. I wonder whether at some point it would make sense to like get out of statue form. Probably not. I mean, probably not unless I get a death talisman. Then I could probably get out of statue form for death form or something. And that would be alright. But otherwise I think... Oh, I've got my... Got to... Mm. That's better. Got to do my fugue again. <laughs> but I still got a good chance to rev up, so it wasn't too bad. Uh, what's this? An animate dead book. Good old animate dead. But I want an army of zombies. I don't massively like the animate ones. They're like, they're fine. They're just... I find them annoying to use, honestly. Is that a... That can't be a triple crossbow. Is that a triple crossbow? That is. Huh. I mean, it's not on a particularly tough enemy. Like, it's the other enemies that make that so much worse. Um, oh, I'll get the long blades up to 20. I know I don't need it for mid delay, but hey, I want it. Where's the pile driver? D, and it's all 1% failure, so I should be able to give it a try. Yeah, not on those guys, because I don't have a wall to push them into. <laughs> Urgh, this is a bit of a okay. Fuck up. Oh, I've still got a view. At least I'm resistant to a storm end, is what I'm thinking. Because I am in the statue form. And the fog might have saved a turn of not getting tormented. I'll try the pile drive on this dude. Oh, it no longer has the minus move. That's nice. Okay, it might be not as bad as it used to be. Um, yeah, it's actually... Somewhat decent, I think. But I still have to be next to someone to actually use it. I still have to be able to push him into the wall, which this terrain is not generating in such a way as I could push guys against uh, walls. I mean, this guy can. I don't know if his damage is based on... Oh, it's not based on my weapon damage, is it? Otherwise, I'll be doing, like, a lot more. Um, No, it's not. So his damage is actually kind of bad, unfortunately. But it could still be good for repositioning occasionally. Alright, well that's, um, okay, got the swamp to go. Almost got the three runes. Let's go to swamp four. See if Lani's waiting for me. Not quite. Oh, there they are. Okay, mirror? That's half the health. Some amount of armor class here. Bring out the little beast and I'll just attack. There we go. Lani's dead. And the rest of these guys should be fairly simple. These are all things so I can just fight. There we go. Got my third rune. So, um, could just have the Zot. <laughs> I guess I will. No Manifold Soul just yet. So, I don't know. How, how are my talismans? Please tell me I'm going to death while I don't. Where's my digging... I know this guy's gonna berserk out, but this is a slightly better spot than what I was in. Hmm. Could all radiate. I get surrounded by guys, a bunch of guys that can do a radiator, and then they give me a book with a radiator in it. Seems very thematically appropriate. Shift was kind of nice, giving me a slow and steady supply of creatures to kill. And now that they don't teleport everything in at once, it's not quite as bad. Um, none of these are bad if they go berserk. In fact, half of those are like mages.
Uh... Oh, another one with Quicksilver. All right. Am I still missing fire resist? That's nasty. If I meet an over fire, I'm going to have to drink a potion of resistance, but... Yeah, I guess that's that's all I can really do. I'm probably a potion of haste because I got some of those as well that I have been using. And maybe I might, I'm not sure. Is that too many potions at once? I mean, maybe not. For a lot of fire. When you've got no fire resist? Oh, no. These fire vigils are awfully suspicious. There's lava as well. I'm gonna leave the lava until a bit later on, but I, I associate lava areas with orbs of fire because I know there are a few vaults that have them. Come on, be a fire resist hat. It is a fire resist hat. Uh, it's minus three slag, though. I lose a armor class. Um, can't two edge. Oh, three decks might help a little bit. Yeah, that makes up for the minus armor class. Shame about the minus slag, though. That's actually kind of bad. I think it's still fine. At least I won't get murdered by the orbs of fire anymore, I guess. Um, that's all gonna berserk up. Man, it's supposed to be the dig again. Okay. Tactical monster also is surely gonna berserk as well. There we go. Ooh. I thought I'd just be able to kill it while it's berserk, but apparently not. Um, I'll try again. Okay. Got it, but there's these other guys here. Oh, the gold dragon can go berserk. I think I might start a teleport. Shadow dragon isn't too bad. Um... Oh, the gold dragon went berserk. I'm probably going to have to blink back. But unfortunately, these guys are so much faster than me, especially when they're berserk. And it's super awkward. Um, Might actually blink into here. Okay. Just drink a healing potion. All right, drink another one as well. Oh, I let the guy through. Okay. Not what I want to see. Um... How long until this teleport goes off? I don't really know. It's been a number of turns, but maybe not enough. Um, I drink another healing. Hey, there we go. Got me out of there eventually. These are the same guys. Oh, the same Moth of Wrath. Um... I think I got them all before the Moth of Wrath noticed me again. Uh, somehow forgot that I was there, I think. That's so exactly what I needed with that Moth of Wrath. Uh, it might not actually be an overfire there. It might just be all sorts of other things. I don't want to get. I mean, I can get some more fighting. Get some more dodging. Actually, instead of that, I might get uh, more Tarazu Cajuns, and I might try to get the spell, so um, let's actually get, throw in a bit of spellcasting as well. Mm, right. But the spell's the most castable. If I could just uh, amnesia something up, maybe. Did I get the... I got the false of Fuse Light, and I never used it, unfortunately. Because that's really helpful with the staircases. So I can, like... Um, If I get some tentacle monster or seas or something blocking a staircase, I can just tell them not to anymore. Just disperse them away and it often works unless they're berserk. Alright, well that's the second level of the dot. It was definitely tough enough. <laughs> Ah, another Moth of Wrath. Okay. I think the right thing to do is Fog. 
There we go. Health is okay. I'm currently slowed, but I'm still doing fine. And I can swap to another staircase at least. Man, these levels are all about their boss of wrath. Uh oh, I'm gonna try and get out of this net. Okay. Ah, another one? Come on. Oh, can I just get out of it? No, that's going to kill me if I stay there any longer. Oh, this is really bad, actually. Man, but I can't get back to that staircase to go heal up. Um, also, this guy can get rid of any sort of things I try and do. And everything's going to go berserk. Um, I got to dig into the wall, I think. Yeah, everything's berserk, um, of course. Drink a healing potion. Drink another healing potion. Can I get a can I get a mite going as well? Because I got tons of those. Okay, I'm revving up. Um I was visible for a little while. I think things have changed into my favor now from where they were before. Oh, but those two dads in a row were just absolutely brutal. Um, good. I think I also failed like my um, attempt to disperse the guys the first time as well, which didn't help either. All right. No, that's now on the eight percent failure, so it's getting a bit less likely. Oh, hey, Pudget. I can't really slow it. Um, I can put on some might. Can't really kill him till the slow wears off, though. I guess I can mirror him up. Maybe that'll do a strike. Yeah, there we go. He's got a plus nine gold dragon armor. I mean, if I want to swap the gold dragon armor, that's, uh, that's my option. It has... I would lose my resist electric, but I think I'd keep uh, keep the fire resist, cold resist, poison resist. I'll lose my resist negative as well. Um, wouldn't be too bad. I might be able to get some auxiliary gear, but I don't think I have stuff with resists. Uh, okay. You know there's a ghost moth there somewhere. Just going to figure out which space it was on. Uh, let's wait for the cloud to get up to me. I think it's better than running off my staircase to go chasing after it or something. That's everyone. What's the chance of getting these guys out of fear? 37%? Okay. You know what? If I get these guys with a vulnerability and then I cast fear on them. Okay. I don't think there's anyone visible left there, so if I just can find another way down, maybe not that way down. Do we have a third way down? We do have a third way down. Excellent. I mean, this brother's definitely feeling doable with Zod's um, a slight challenge, which sometimes is uh, definitely a bit of a spike, but not always. Depends on the character. Some characters go through just fine, but no, this is a little bit of a power spike for this character. Still think this is fine. Yeah, I mean, that's just a couple of random draconian dudes. There we go, there's another one that I can fight. So we've got another moth there. Alright. Okay, do it to me. I think it's trying to hit me with an elemental up 
Oh, there's not enough people. So, uh, what is it even called? I know it's the, the same one that the, um, Quasar's got. It, is, oh, it might just be called upheaval. It might not have the word elemental. Okay, I'll hide in the wall. I don't think too much is going to come along. Yeah, nothing came along. One more level, Zot. Um, oh, hey, there's my first orb of fire. Hey, I even got technical monster across the upstairs. Right, well, next staircase, I guess. That one looks uh, a little crowded. I'm going to shout. See what I get. Feels stupid. That's, mm, that's acceptable. Spells are less powerful. I mean, I could probably have this many cast manifold assault. Um, I really probably could. I just don't have it. Uh, do I reset those? I don't think so. I think those are acceptable for now, unfortunately. <laughs> They do make the spells a bit worse. Also, I should really be magic mapping out this level. I've already got two, but I'll do it. Yeah, so we've got... Oh, the alarm trap and the spousal trap. Well, probably the alarm trap side. I got a cancellation, right? Uh, Yeah, I got two of them. Okay. Sure, let's, uh, let's make my way into here. What am I doing with my title anyway? I haven't thought about that, but what actually am I doing with that one? Uh, let me go check on Cognitive Titles. I might not have time to get a title here. Um, I have had, I've had Shapeless, I've had Slayer, Iron Golem, Fungal, Paler, Storting, Demonologist, Cogmind. Cogland Blade, okay. Cogland Aeon, so I've had the Swords one already. Um. Well, oh. he's not doing the right thing there. Uh. Huh. I haven't had the throwing one, but like at this point, getting throwing is pretty hard. Um. I might go check if there's any unique Cogland ones. I've kind of left it rather late to be getting a title here, haven't I? Um, let's go look at the unique ones. Armor. Iron Golem, I had that. It's Cogmind. Invocations with Fetters. I might just do some, like, extra things, but, like... I actually don't mind the sound of that. Oh, wait, it's all the way to 27. Oh, I was telling you a little bit on that. Where's my cancellation? Okay. But yeah, this character's not gonna be able to stop here. Um, they're gonna have to keep it going. I don't have that many haste, unfortunately. But I'll drink one. How am I getting dispersed around awkwardly here? Also, I don't. Uh, I'm also killing things pretty well, but. That's fine. I've still got my buffs on, right? Uh, uh, I might need to blink back. I don't know. This is looking... Oh, yeah. I've dispelled away buffs, unfortunately. Is that even healing me? I don't know if it is. No, I'm actually taking too much damage here. Wow. Trying to heal here is not working at all. These guys just keep on hitting me. Um, I'll try another one, but no, it's really not helping. How do I get out of here? Do these guys get affected by fear? Not really. I'm gonna try summoning. Oh, it's a goddamn boss that did everything with Zoe can make my situation worse. I hate that summoning effect on the summoning scroll. It's the worst thing ever. Uh, Zoki up the enemies. I'm gonna have to use another blink here, aren't I? After that. I mean, I can step back once more. Maybe another time. Yup. Ah, that's bizarre. It's just gonna murder me if I don't blink out of there. Alright. Oh, armfits probably doesn't matter. Okay, sure. 
I mean, I should be fine now. This cost me a couple of blink scrolls to get out of there, which was really sad. Um, I don't think I'm getting the title I'm after either <laughs> with this character. Everything's going wrong, but it's fine. I'm going to live, but... I might not get the title I'm after. <laughs> And I might not get Manifold Soul, which was the whole point of this character. Oh, I feel frail. I probably should reset that one. Um, yeah, let's go do it right now. I've got four mutations that could make these worse. Let's see. So, I'm no longer frail. I'm fist poly's fine. Because small pair of horses is fine. I'm just less encumbering is nothing. But that's fine. Uh, that side is not the side I want to go down. Otherwise, I might get dispersal trapped in. I should probably exclude out that dispersal trap. Um, oh, I cannot drink potions. That's awkward. Uh, I'll try the summoning again, but. Huh? Good, I can now drink potions again. Let's do the might. This is sketchy, but I'm going to stand on teleport trap, see where I end up. Oh, I marked. Okay, that's uh, that's really bad. Let me just cancel that one up. Oh, I, wait, why am I still marked? Was I drink? Might. Oh. That's terrible. I think I'm gonna have to drink a blink. Uh sorry to get rid of the mic though. That's worse. Um Man, it's gonna cost me a lot to get out of here. I should drink a taste, but I can't say where I am. This is sketchy. Um, huh? I think I just head to the staircase now. Yeah, that was costly. A little trip through there. Maybe I should have stood on that trap. Um, it really didn't help me out. So I got frail. Got low magical capacity. Okay, let's do a reset. But I don't have that much resetting left to me. Okay, go with the frail. The resistance to further mutations, which is nice. And the holes in my heads are actually helpful as well. Um. Oops, that's not it. I might do a resistance. Ow. I should have done a haste. Oh, no. Ow, I didn't even get to the guy. I'm running out of steam here. Um, I put all my buffs and then I got too wounded. Okay, well. I put on the resistance, I put on the mine, and then I go down, but... Uh, frail and not doing as much damage as I'd like to this guy. And of course the cloud goes behind me. Uh, of course it does. Okay, how am I resist now? Uh, I've got frail again. I think I can really afford to worry about that one anymore. <laughs> My last, uh... Wait, is that my last resistance gone? Okay. Potions are less effective, I see. How many orbs of fire are left? Um, maybe still a few, unfortunately. All right. Oh, I mean, it's definitely one right there. I think I just berserk it, honestly. I mean, I'm running out of other resources, and berserk will do a good job of taking it out, so... Yeah, I mean, I guess I berserk this one as well, but... Mm. Definitely scraping the bottom of the barrel here with my potions. Just doing what I've got. Oh, wait, hold on. I need to go buy a blink scroll, because I know I still have one of those left. Um... 
Oh, hello, little Lok. It's not so scary anymore. Okay, so got that one. And I think there was some other things left. There's some um, cancellation, which I might end up needing. We'll see. Depends how many times I get alarmed from now on. I should definitely be grabbing these things, though. Uh, I don't really need the cure anymore, do I? Nah, that doesn't help. Uh, I want a potion of resistance. Okay, cool. How many blink do I have left? Four. Hopefully that's enough for the orb run. Orb run and uh... Sad you form is always a little bit harder. Okay. I want that alarm trap of youth. That's what I was trying to get out of you, but I was like, uh, I didn't want to be like too far into the area there. I'm pulling this guy up this way. It's pulling away from the alarm traps. I might be on like airport though, rude. Because I got airportation sitting here at 1% failure. Oh, that was I think that's probably the right idea. Yeah, I'm never going to get that title. I'm never going to get... Uh, okay, I'll just go with my current one. That's fine. It's good enough. Let's, uh, let's support this rude. Go to Dungeon Zero. <laughs> of course, it wasn't going to just work like that. Uh... Okay, can I just... <sighs> like I can torment, this is... This is sketchy, I'm kind of wounded right now. I'll get rid of the cancellation, get rid of my corrosion, but then there's this guy that's hazed up. Can I just quick sew it up? Um, I want a little bit more health, and I want to take out a mirror. Uh... Now nah, I might silence. I might have to get rid of the silence at some stage, so it's a bit of a trade-off. Um, all right, I might be able to brosy up a little bit. I didn't actually buy many of brosia, so I'm, I'm kind of short on those, but hey. That's a demon I can kill. And how many blinking did I have? I got four blinking. Good. They so got a few at least. Um, I couldn't quite get a second. So let's say fog. Pull this guy back. There we go. Lightning bolt. It's not actually looking that tough. It's got some evasion, but that's about it to it. Um, I'm probably better off just taking the teleport trap though. Yeah, perfect. Oh. Another tough guy as I'm making my way up. Um, Where am I going? Just down this way somewhere. Don't know exactly where, but I will keep on heading this way. It looks like where the auto explorer was trying to go. Or the auto travel, not the auto explorer. It's, it's middle again. I got one not a torment on me, or maybe it was two. Not entirely sure, but either way, I got a bit of torment on me. Got blink balls. Okay, blink ball up to me, and it looks considerably tougher than some of the other ones. Uh, I might do a teleport. It'll take a while to go off. Yeah, this is a blink bolt. Can I just head over the warping wall and just blink bolt back up to me? Yeah, I'll probably just blink bolt back up, but now that I've teleported out, um, might just be able to take one of these staircases. And I should be going to each up staircase and try to rest back my health on another that's working with those guys. 
Just thought I could get back in bed as I make my way up here, although I don't seem to be getting a chance to rest, as it turns out. Actually, I'm on full health, so I can just keep it going up. Okay, let's... Oh, hold up. Hold up, I got blinking cat, and I know what the staircase is, so... <laughs> let's just do this the quick way. Uh, get my way out of there. Unfortunately, never found Manifold Salt. So the human was kind of wasted on this character. But that's alright. We still got a win in the end. Yep. And uh, the weapons are great. That gold wrecked up would have been great if I had a gold statue form. Well, that's a win. And a win's a win, I guess. <laughs> Even if it's slightly disappointing. But a quick win, though. Anyway, I might finish up around here. Go see if I can raid someone. There's got to be someone streaming, right? Nope, no one's streaming down to crawl. Someone's streaming something else, let's see. There's... Do, 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 do. Who is there streaming right now? Oh, there's Abby son streaming Baldur's Gate. I might go raid Abby. See what, he, uh, what he's up to in Baldur's Gate. See where he's up to in Baldur's Gate. 